Hi everybody, my name is Amber and today I'm going to show you guys a fix to a apparently common error that uh, sims, simmers are running into when it comes to create a world. And uh, this fix is very simple, but it is very specific, so this won't help with every error. Now the error I'm talking about is when you open up the Sims 3 uh, create a world, uh, this error pops up that says exception information attempted to read or write protected memory. This is often an indication that other memory is corrupt. Now what causes this is the world adventures or uh, one of the expansion pack updates uh, that you will have if you have kept your Sims 3 game up to date like myself, especially after Origin uh, started ha to have to run when you play. So chances are a lot of people who had this before that did not keep their game updated are having this problem now, which is kind of confusing because when I looked online there was no fix and it was really frustrating. So um, I found a fix and it's kind of embarrassing, but what you need to do is you need to uninstall The Sims 3 Create a World. Now I used Revo Uninstaller Pro just to get uh, rid of everything and anything, so I just un un uh, uh, uninstall it. And it just kind of takes a little bit of time here. And while this is working, I'm going to go to the Create a World page. Now, this is not a third party site. This is not MegaShare or anything like that. This is the Sims 3 site. I will include a link in the description for both the uninstaller tool, which does come with a free trial, and the Sims 3 game tool, game, game tools world. Uh, and from this site, you can download it. I would not recommend downloading it from any other site because obviously there's risk of viruses and all sorts of kind of stuff if it's not from the actual site. Uh, anyways, so what I did before, <laughs> which a lot of people probably did because it's the first link, this says uh, this download is compatible with The Sims 3 version 1.7. Now, what we need if you're getting that error is the compatible with the sims 3 version 1.9 so after you download that which i already have so i'm going to go ahead and cancel that you open it up just like you did with the world tool world tool only it's called the sims 3 ts3 uh ciw create a world so you open that up and you install it just like you installed the other one nothing is different and i will show you after this installs, everything fixes itself. I'm going to quickly close this stuff up because I don't like a lot of things running. Anyways, I'm going to finish that, close this. Sans is running around. It's a lot of fun. Okay. Anyways, so here is the new uh, Create a Sims world tool, world tool. I'm going to go ahead and open this up, and if we're lucky, no errors will appear and everything will be in order. And that is what we want. There we go. Okay, so I don't know how to play this game, I'm gonna learn, but that error is easily fixed by downloading the appropriate uh, application that is compatible with The Sims 3 1.69. Now, once again, I'm going to include this link in the description. If you're having a different error, what I would suggest doing is installing this version. If that doesn't work, uninstall it completely using the tool I link and then reinstall it. Now, there is a good chance that it may not work if your computer is giving you trouble. You can keep Googling, and unfortunately, that is the only error I've been having, so that is the only one I can really help with. I do hope that this fixes everybody's issue, uh, and I hope that uh, you guys can create some awesome worlds and stuff. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. If you want to hear more uh, silly game fixes that uh, chicks and guys who don't really know a lot about computers or programs kind of face, uh, I guess subscribe because I kind of find a lot of those kind of problems. Um, anyways, have a great day guys and again thank you so much for watching. Bye now.